Mary's Missionary Church. My, my name is Mary Tem Alfusner and I'm coming from Peter Marisberg, KZN. Amen. What is the problem that you're facing in your life that made you to come here? The problem that I'm facing uh, in my life that made me uh, come here, the pastor, he told me everything. Mm. Everything. Uh, even something that I didn't expect that he will tell me. Mm. Something for 22 years ago. Mm. But today he was telling me. Amen. Yes. And he, he touched the issue of your brother. He told me the issue of my brother. Mm -hmm. My brother was missing it about 22 years ago. Mm. And I was just amazing when he told me, mm. did I want my brother to come back because yeah. I think my brother he died. Mm. I don't think he yeah. still is, is still alive. Mm. And secondly, he told me about my taxi business. Mm. Yes, my taxi business are going down now. Yeah. He told me about the sugar diabetes and the high blood pressure and he even told me I'm not performing now mm. just because of that. Mm. And the end of fair, uh, and of all that he said, that it will be done. Hallelujah. Thank you. And he prayed for you at that particular moment when he was praying for you, especially when he was praying for your business. How did you feel? I feel that it's true because he picked it up. Amen. I didn't tell him that about the, the taxi business, but he picked it up himself. So if he picked it up, then I strongly believe that it will help me. Yes. And he also prayed for you, the, the problem of your health. Were you taking any medication for this problem? Yes, I'm taking the medication for, uh, for sugar diabetes. Mm. Yes. And was it helping? Yeah, it was helping, but it's just the medication and when you take it, you're taking it for life. Yeah. Maybe after he touched me, mm -hmm. it will be, it's something that will help Hallelujah. me. Hallelujah. Also, also mention about my, my, my children. Yes. yes. He said he will help me on my children. Hallelujah. Yes. And I strongly believe that all what he told me, it will come right. Hallelujah. Yeah. And when he was speaking about your children, he also prayed for these papers that you're holding in your hands and he said it will help your children also. Yes, just because these papers is my business. So maybe about that he was mentioning that my children it will also come to the business and uh, and work with me. Amen. Yeah. And how are you feeling right now?
from this cage. In Jesus' mighty name, God bless you. God bless you. I'm feeling very, I'm feeling very. <laughs> I'm feeling very, very blessed Amen. that after he told me that now, I think everything uh, came right. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. What can you say to the viewers out there? As the prophet of God was able to tell you things that happened 22 years back, yes. and you did not even tell him, he even touched the issue of your family without you mentioning it. What are the words of encouragement that you can give to the viewers out there? As I believe that today, God has done it for you in Jesus' name. Furthermore, I wasn't even coming to that thing that happened 22 years ago mm -hmm. about my brother's thing. Mm -hmm. So the viewers there, I have to tell them that, uh, you know, the chariot, mm -hmm. it's a, it's a, it, it was the first time I heard that. Mm -hmm. So I've been Sangomas and all over, yeah. but uh, here I just, uh, I'm strongly believe that uh, I will be blessed. Hallelujah. Yeah. We give glory to Jesus for life. We believe that as the prophet of God has prayed for you, your business is restored, your children are restored, your health is restored, and you are coming back with a testimony that will shock all your enemies in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Thank you. Sir. Thank you. Charis Missionary Church. My name is Matabo Masilela. I came here looking for financial breakthrough, um, marital issues. Um, and just, just break through on the normal. And I'm also having an upcoming um, ordination, so I wanted to also God to direct me on that. Break it down to us. What is really happening to you? <coughs> there is no finances. Since we got married, nothing is working up. It's like we've gone down. We lost our house in June. Uh, my husband lost his job. Really, there is nothing. There's nothing that's happening. Yeah. And how did it affect you? It affects every area of our lives because then we, our house got taken away. We, lo we lost our house and now we stay in somebody else's house. So we are like practically homeless. And yeah, so it affects every area of our lives. Yeah. And you saw the prophet of God on a one-on-one -on -one session. What did he say to you regarding this problem? He told me about the house. He told us about me that, about the house and that he sees the house that is bonded, that is taken away from us. Um, he sees that since we are married, nothing is going um, up. Everything's going down. Um, he says that my husband will get a job. Um, he says that there is a problem of jealousy in from the families and stuff like that. So he did. He did talk to me about the issue. And how are you feeling right now? I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm excited to see the breakthrough, um, and excited to go home and share it with my family and my husband. Yes. Um. Come on.
Tell your husband that you will get a job. words of encouragement that you can give to the viewers out there is I believe that the Almighty God has done it for you today in Jesus' name. I think people are impatient. Um, I think one of the things that you have to know is to be patient. Number two, um, you have to know that the Spirit of, the God, of God is here. If you believe in God, not in a human being, God who uses the human being, then everything happens. Because sometimes people come and say, I didn't see Apostle, I saw Mama or I saw Prophet, and they get discouraged. And don't, don't do that. The Spirit of the Lord is here at Charis. And we've been uh, with Charis for long. I've been with Charis for long. So we have seen, we have seen testimonies. We are testimonies. And uh, that's why we come here, because we know the Spirit of the Lord is here. So come and be patient and just uh, open, uh, open your heart and let the Lord, allow the Lord to use whoever he wants to use through your life. We give glory to Jesus for your life. Thank you. Thank you, thank you Lord. Thank you, Jesus.